Right, so assalamualaikum and good day to everyone once again. So the task for this week, okay, this is the task. Okay, as I said before, the submission of your task is the proof of your attendance for every week. So you must uh, finish this task and I'm giving you until the end of this week, okay, to submit the task. Okay, so what, it, what is the task? Okay, first of all, I will upload an audio in your Google Classroom. Okay, so you listen to the audio given. And then while you listen, you take note and highlight the important points or issues highlighted by the speaker. Okay, after that, okay, once you have jot down all the points and everything, you illustrate your point into a mind map using the application given by me. Okay, so today I will show you one application that you can use to create a mind map. Okay, now if you feel that you can do a mind map using any other application or any other software then feel free to do so okay you don't have it's not necessarily that you have to follow what i show you today okay what i'm showing you is just one example if maybe you are familiar with any other application or any other software then you, you may use it okay so basically in the mind map you are trying to summarize the information okay so what needs to be in the mind map there must be an intro intro is basically what is the the whole idea okay what 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 is the whole idea of the uh, you know issue highlighted okay why do they highlight this issue why is it important okay and then a body a body would be what are the summary of the main points okay for example if they talk about the importance of exercise okay maybe they include three or four uh, important points okay why exercise are important so you 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 branch your mind map into four component okay and then if there's any opinion and finally you create your own conclusion okay so the layout of the mind map is up to you as long as there are these three things intro a body and a conclusion in the mind map the layout is up to you feel free to to use your own imagination okay now that is the task so what is the software that I want to share with you? Okay, now if you go to Google and you type in C O G G L E, okay, you'll have this called Coggle. Okay, maybe some of you have heard of it, and maybe for some of you this is the first time. Now Coggle is basically it's a mind mapping web application. It's free. Okay, it's uh, you know it's from Google. So as long as you have a Google account, if if you have a Gmail account, then it's free of charge. Okay, so no problem. So you click on that. Okay, so once you click, okay, because I already have uh, my own account, okay, so you sign in and everything, and then you come to your own, and then you just click, click, create diagram. So when you, once you create the create diagram part, okay, you'll have this. This is the, uh, the sort of the page or the space that you're going to create your uh, mind map. And here on the, on the right side, they also include a few sort of shortcuts of uh, of how you're going to use okay as you can see if you want to type in new item shift and then enter if you want to create a sub okay new child item is the sub point then you just tap okay if you want to jump to parent if you want to create another uh, main point okay shift and tap okay so shortcuts okay if you want to remove a branch just control and click x Okay, if you want to insert a branch, okay, so you can go through this, okay, I think you will be familiar with this because I'm sure many of you play game and it's, it's quite simple, you know, for you, for you guys, it will be simpler because you're familiar with shortcuts and everything, even your, your text messaging, you're using abbreviation and shortcuts, okay, so basically, once you're here, it's very simple, you just click to edit title, so there, you can write what is the title of the speech, okay, for example, if the speaker is talking about how to deal with stress, so you type in, okay, for example, okay, how to deal with stress, okay, so that is the main point, now, if you want to create sort of a branch, okay, for example, maybe you want to create an introduction, see, you just click in, they'll create that line for you so you can type there okay uh sort of intro okay what is the intro okay or maybe okay intro and then you want to go down okay or maybe just uh, a sort of a marker okay and then you write what is the intro okay so the speaker or maybe you don't want to in caps so the speaker uh, wants to highlight dangers of 
are not dangerous the 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 effects of stress on our life thus thus we need ways to deal with it okay okay so maybe for example i don't know i i I haven't heard of the audio yet so this is just my sort of assumption okay the intro if it's not something else then you just type in something else okay then if you want to add in a, another branch for example okay click another branch maybe what is the first point your body right so first point you can just type in that first point okay what is the first point okay for example and then okay let's say i just type in first point uh, exercise to release stress so let's say that is the first point okay now if you want to create another branch out of there you can just type click in just click somewhere here and then you can just click anywhere on the side and you can straight away start typing okay exercise to release stress for example okay you can say for example playing badminton okay so it will be there so if you want to create sort of a, a branch okay a link okay another branch so it's up to you or if you don't want then you can even delete okay if you, if you don't want to put it there or if you want to sort of maybe link it to somewhere else okay so there you go okay so you can you can work your way around okay you can explore trying to you know try to work your way around this Okay, and do you know you can add another branch, add another branch, and then if once you have done this, you want to uh, drag the size, make it bigger, and then if you just want to write anything, you just can click there. There'll be a box for you to write a text box for you to write, and once you write in your point, you can even like if you want to attach it to some. Maybe you think this could also join into another separate point for example or maybe if you think this could also go into this point so you can just drag so sorry you can drag here just click on this button here sorry ah see okay If you think this could also be the same so you see you can just drag so it means that these two are the same so it's up to you so you can explore this okay you can make as as complicated as you want or you can make it as simple as you want and the layout is up to you so once we have done that once we have finished all, everything here okay you can if you see here share this coggle or you can download this coggle okay first we can you or you want to present this coggle so i suggest once you have done you download this coggle okay once you click download okay you can download it as pdf or you can even download this as image okay now i want you to download as image so that i don't have to i don't uh, you see when you upload later i don't have to download your pdf file so you download as image okay you click that you download as image okay save image as okay so you can save your image as uh, the name of you want and then you post it in your uh, Google classroom under the assignment Okay, so that would be your task for today. Okay. I hope it's clear If you have any question you can ask me and I remind you that the submission of your task Is the proof of your attendance for today. Okay, so that's all. Thank you very much. Please make sure you submit the tasks